On the eastern side of Cuba, near Guantanamo Bay, is the small town of Boya Riba. A crowd of more than 500 people has gathered for the dedication of a new house of light. A steady rain falls on the crowd as they wait for the service to begin. The people try to stay dry as the ribbon is cut and the doors to the new building are pushed open. The pews fill up quickly as people rush to find seats before the building overflows. The Adventist church in Cuba isn't allowed to build new church buildings, but they are allowed to renovate old ones. It just so happens that this pastor's house has a living room that will hold more than 250 people each Sabbath. The church members sing songs of praise and gratitude as they show their thanks for their new house of worship. At the service are representatives from Maranatha Volunteers International, a lay member organization that's been responsible for rebuilding this house of light. Maranatha's worked in Cuba for more than 15 years and they've worked on virtually every building that the Adventist Church in Cuba has built. Maranatha has truly caught the global mission of the Seventh-day Adventist Church and has helped lead the growth in this country. The evening ends with a short devotional and then the new baptismal tank is put into service as 15 people are baptised. The rain that soaked the members as they waited for their house of light to open couldn't put out the flames of faith that burn in each of their hearts. Amen.